Hey, hey, another word from me. I am so tired of these whining liberal vagina whiners out there that it is totally ridiculous. Making assumptions that you know what's in the Constitution or what's in the Bill of Rights, what executive powers that the President has, what powers the Congress has, and what powers the judicial system has, is all spelled out in our Bill of Rights and in this United States Constitution for we the people. Get a copy and read it. Now, I'm not, I'm not a constitutional lawyer, but I do know how to read. I do know how to try to comprehend things that are sort of iffy to me in research on it. And when I do, it's like, oh, wow, okay, yeah. Well, they do have the right for that or they don't have the right for that. Man, what don't you understand about... This is... Trump's trying to make our country strong. Trying to make our country safe. Do I agree with everything he's doing and the way he's doing it? No. No, I don't. But he's not a career politician that sits on his laurels, that's just there to make this ridiculous salary even after they're out of office, because really they only work part-time. They, they get paid compensated afterwards it's almost as much as what they make in health care for the rest of their lives. How many of them have Obamacare? How many? I don't think very many of them do. Um, little tangent there. Sorry for that. But yeah, pick up. Get in touch with me. I'll mail you copies of these. I've mailed them to people in the past. If need be, I'll get you a copy of the Bill of Rights. But you can Google them both and read them. It's real simple. Make America safe. No, I don't want to be an isolationist nation. I want us to prosper. I want us to have friends on the other side of the world in different hemispheres. I want there to be good, fair, equal trade. I do want to see people come to our country, but legally. Not as a refugee status. Not where we have homeless veterans, homeless citizens, welfare ranks that are just astronomical because we don't have any jobs. J-O-B. Jobs. You know, the, the Democrats are, are harping on all this, and we've got all those protests, and you know what, that's... And, and I listen to it, and I and, and I uh, laugh my ass off out loud, L-M-A-O, at some of these weepy-eyed, crying... Bill Schumer, <laughs> Miley Cyrus, and the rest of these idiot actors that, if it wasn't for us, they wouldn't have a job. But there I go off on another tangent again. But uh, uh, my my whole point of this is that no laws in this land supersede this bad boy. This is the law of our land. What's so hard to understand about that? If it's not in the Constitution... It's really not viable. Not viable at all. Okay, I've said my piece. Um, honor and love God. Honor and love your family. Honor and love your nation. Do what's right. My other reminder, go out and get yourself some extra food, extra water, extra ammo. And love, love, love your family. Love your neighbor. Even if we all don't get along. That's, that's fine. We're not supposed to. It's what you call a point of view or an opinion. Opinion. Doesn't make your opinion or my opinion right. It doesn't make it wrong. It's just a talking point. So maybe we can get things straight. All right, y'all. I'm going to go. Y'all have yourself a blessed day. All right. I am out. Peace.